That's the um, Olympic torch. When it came through Philadelphia in 1996, I ran up the art museum steps. <laughs> but that would be great if we could like, figure out. The moment that sort of my life changed was in the seventh grade when my first coach, who was this, this amazing uh, black woman, put me on the varsity basketball team. And that had never happened before, that a seventh grader would play bas you know, varsity ball that she saw me. That's one of the reasons I love to play sports, is also because, you know, I could move. What does it feel like to be, you know, in the air, you know, with a layup or, uh, you know, to be flying? I was very competitive. And I think, you know, because I was discipline and I thought I could be able to do anything. I, I think I think sports chose me. I think basketball chose me. I don't know how other people operate, but I know I know how I operate right. and you know I I just wanna be me. Because that's me. Right. That's that's who I am. <laughs> Daily and I push each other's buttons like there's no other. She really, really likes to yell at me all the time. I could do something great, but she's still yelling at me, and I'm like, oh my gosh, done. <laughs> just get, just, I just need a break. I don't consider myself like powerful. Um, I have to set a great example. I have to keep them understanding that there's a, you know, there's a bigger picture than, you know, what they think they're going through today. I think that's power in knowing that you can help someone else see that. Um, see their, see their light. That's the biggest power. Power to empower. Yeah, yeah. power to empower. Yeah. Some things aren't, you know, privy to certain people. Right. Um, you know, I, I, I grew up in an impoverished um, neighborhood. Most, you know, people that didn't live there that were, look at, that, that were looking in um, thought it was just probably just a poor, trashy neighborhood. Like, I think I'm a, a, a living testimony of, of someone beating the odds. You know, I, I just, you know, I just feel like, I just feel like, you know, a beacon of hope for someone who looks like me, who grew up like me. Coaches, uh, she is a very, very important person in my life. And it's, and it's just so simple, but just like the simple words of just go. She really tells me just go, 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 like no matter what. And I think that's just something that really pushes me in life. It's just go, go for it. Like, just go for it. Your, your path isn't written. You can always start and, you know, stop and start a new path. It's hard figuring out who you are what you stand for, what you like, what you dislike, you know, what, you know, what, what your heart desire is. Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm happy I'm in a place where I can help younger people hopefully figure it out a lot sooner than not. She's modeling 
not what she wants her players to be like her, but for them to like connect to that source that they can be who they are in the world. That modeling, that's like, that's, a, that's very special. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank <laughs> you.